Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia represents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast. Armenians of Dersim of Western Armenia visited Yerevan city. No violation of ceasefire regime have been recorded in Artsakh, Ministry of Defense of Russian Federation. The UN Human Rights Council adopts the genocide prevention resolution proposed by Armenia. The Baralit village club in Javakh will be renovated. The military touches of EU and NATO member states accredited in Armenia visited their bus of Minister of Defense of Republic of Armenia. A villa will be built in Sakhert Cemetery in Western Armenia. Mountain climbers could not overcome Mount Ararat. Dance art in Western Armenia, Kochari. A group of Western Armenian citizens from Dersim province of Western Armenia visited the Yerevan representative office of Western Armenia. Among the guests was also the representative of Dersim, Dersim High Platform, Asatur Balkis. The guests were hosted by Western Armenian Prime Minister Seda Melikian. During the meeting, a number of important issues aimed at activating the activities of citizens of Western Armenia. Both in Armenia and Dersim were discussed. An agreement was reached and cooperation in a field of culture between the citizens of Western Armenia. Armenia. In Artsakh, occupied by the Azerbaijani army, they have no violation of the ceasefire regime in the area of responsibility of the Russian peacekeeping contingent in Artsakh over the past day. It is reported by the Ministry of Defense of Russian Federation. Russian peacekeepers conduct round-the-clock monitoring of compliance with the ceasefire regime at 27 observation posts and monitor the situation. No violation have been recorded in the area of responsibility of the Russian peacekeeping contingent, the report says. On March 31, during the 49th session of the UN Human Rights Council, the resolution Prevention of Genocide put forward by Armenia was adopted by consensus. This is reported by the press service of the RA, Ministry of Foreign Affairs. The resolution traditional presented by Armenia describes the steps to be jointly implemented by the UN member states to prevent the tragedy of genocide, its recognition, restoration of justice, compensation, punishment of the perpetrators. The resolution raises such problems as taking measures to to assess the risks of conflict and prevent them and the abuse of new technologies. In the village of Baralet of Akhakalak municipality, a tender has been announced for the restoration of the club, which has been in the deplorable state for many years. It was built in the 16th of the last century. The celebration hall is a poor condition, although the villagers still use it. The entrance to the building is also in poor condition. There is no glass in the windows, the floor is destroyed, the walls are damp and covered with mold. However, this year it was decided to run away the club in one of the large villages of the Akhakalak municipality. Acceptance of the proposal was ended on March 28. Only one participant took part in a tender auction, Vartak Mikoyan. The work must be completed 60 days after the renovation of conditions. The roof, walls and floor are subject to repair. Doors and windows made of metal plastic will be installed. The military touches of EU and NATO members, state aggregated in Armenia, visited the Airbus N of the Ministry of Defense of Republic of Armenia. The commander of the Airbus Aviation Colonel, Samvel Tavadian, acquainted a foreign guest with the daily activities of the military unit and answered their questions. Then the military touches turned to territory of the military unit, got acquainted with aviation weapons and military equipment. The Su 30 SM aircraft aroused a great interest for the guest. The military touches noted that as a result, of the visit, they were once again convinced that four Su-30 SM aircraft in a place and that information exaggerated in Azerbaijan and Turkish press that they are participating in hostilities in Ukraine is not true. The place called the Bacchus Gorge is located near the center of the city of Sakhert in Western Armenia and according to the Association for Human Rights, occupies 405 decades. It is known as the place where numerous Armenians killed during the genocide of 1915 were buried. At the same time, people who become victims of state killings called unsolved murders are buried here. According to some reports, the remains of last 300 courts are located here. For the first time in 1989, as a result of drilling work, the remains of eight people were discovered in a few hours. By order of the party, the work has been suspended on the same day, and after that, no work was carried out. Over time, construction work began in the gorge. Roads were first built on a territory that turned into a garbage dam, then permission was given to the wedding salon. This was not enough. A police academy was built, and now buildings and villas will be built on a territory where hundreds of Kurds and thousands of Armenians were buried. 
A group of climbers who tried to climb the top of Mount Ara twice a week were unable to reach the summit due to bad weather conditions. According to the calendar adopted by the International Federation of Mountaineering, the period from December 21 to March 21 is provided for winter climbing. In order to climb Mount Ara, five climbers from Western Armenia arrived in the province of Dogu Bayazet. The team started the first climb to reach a height of 5,137 meters. However, it was not possible to overcome. The next day, they began to overcome the attitude again and despite heavy snowfall and a snowstorm reached the height up to 4150 meters. There were only 887 meters left to reach the summit but the team members were unable to move forward due to heavy snow and blizzard and had to return back. It should be noted that Mount Arad symbolizing the eternity of Armenian nation and Western Armenia has always been unpredictable due to the climate condition and overcoming its height really requires great will and strengths. The old Armenian Kochari dance, which occupies its firm place in a rich culture of Western Armenia, originates in ancient times. The Kochari dance has presented traces of unity of Armenian ancestral society. Its trace is in the dance itself. Kochari is a final dance of victors. Each triumphant campaign was followed by sacrifice in honor of the deified ancestors. Now the musical part, Armenian folk song, Angela Atabegyan's song. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.